history of Bay Area rap, Woody. A lot of people ask me to make this video and I'm happy to do it because there's a lot of things I respect about him. Woody grew up in Antioch and he got involved in the gang life early on. He lost his friend Blackbird to a police shooting and his friend Snoop to the feds, which pushed him to get into music and enter the rap game. He used his own production, his own money, and started his own label, East Coco Records. That's another thing I really respect. He kept the Bay independent spirit alive, and he also really represented for his city. He dropped Yak Influence in 1998, which had the local hit Norte Siding, and in 1999 he dropped the first of his Northern Exposure compilations, which was a local hit, did really well. He dropped several albums, all featuring his homies, and he put on a lot of people, including Big Tone, who went on to have his own career. He was closely affiliated with the Jacka, and he was highly respected as a rap cat. In 1997, he tragically took his own life, but a lot of people keep his memory alive today.